First Alert Weather is brought to you by the Medical Center. It felt warm and muggy yesterday afternoon as we started to get a little bit more humidity back into play. Even though the temperature didn't crack 90 degrees, it was the humidity, the amount of moisture that's in the air that made it feel uncomfortable. And we're going to have that today with a little bit more in the way of heat. I think today we will top 90 degrees, maybe even into the low 90s. 70 right now, nothing showing up on First Alert Live. Doppler radar not expecting any kind of shower activity really today as the air is uh, going to be stable enough to keep any shower activity away from us. Here's a look at temperatures right now. And this all coming in real time from the Kentucky Mesonet at Western Kentucky University and all of their uh, Mesonet sites, individual uh, weather station sites in real time, picking up all the temperatures here, upper 60s to the north, low 70s to the south. And not only do we pick up temperature, we pick up wind and humidity, dew points, all of that, so we can see in real time how things are going to be or how things are. And then we can also see back archived uh, information that also helps us with the uh, uh, current information. Barron River Lake, of course, that's our hometown forecast pinpoint for today. 92 for Bowling Green, 91 Glasgow, 92 for Franklin, 91 for Scottsville today. Mostly sunny all the way around. By the way, the uh, Kentucky Lottery Powerball jackpot for Wednesday night estimated to be at $116 million, while Mega Millions estimated to be at 20 million dollars. Air quality is still low in the pollen count. That's mainly grass pollen. We'll begin to work in a little ragweed as we go through the next few weeks, but right now we're okay. It's ozone and mold, both in the moderate category. So if you have kind of a what we call the summertime sneezes and the summertime colds that are going around, well, this is the reason why right there, UV index running high with all the sunshine we're expecting today. And here's live from Doppler Cam. Beautiful clear start to the day, 70 degrees with a calm wind and the pressure holding steady. There's our AAA Systems weather cam in Franklin. You're starting with a clear 71 degrees, 69 in Litchfield and a sunny start in Grayson County. Jamestown Marina, 67 degrees at Lake Cumberland this morning. 72 at the airport, 72 Knoxville, 75 Indianapolis, 76 in Memphis. Radar over the last 12 hours showing a pretty quiet period here. High pressure, big dome of high pressure in control of the weather, sitting right over about Ohio this morning, and it's uh, encompassing all the way down into the Tennessee River Valley, and it's going to stay that way at least for, say, the next 24 hours. Any kind of shower activity is going to be on the outer ring of that ridge of high pressure, which extends all the way out into the Mississippi River Valley. There is that high pressure center. Now around us, there will be these little isolated showers that pop up during the heat of the day, but not necessarily here in Bowling Green or Southern Kentucky. Tomorrow, we stand a better chance of having that happen as the high moves a little bit further south and east, then we'll be more into that zone where we get a little bit more daytime heating and then a little bit more of the moisture interacting with that and a pop-up shower or two can't be ruled out. Better chances of getting some rain, though, as we get closer to the weekend. The forecast today, mostly sunny, hot, humid, 92 with the heat index mid to possibly upper 90s. 73 tonight, mainly clear, but it will be warm and muggy. Tomorrow, up to 93 with the heat index in the upper 90s and that slight chance of that pop-up shower or two. Same for Thursday. Friday, a little better chance in there of that happening, but... It's Saturday and Sunday, both weekend days, when an actual cold front will be moving into the area. That will set off a 50% chance that you could get rained, uh, rained on Saturday and Sunday, and then even some showers on Monday and turning a bit cooler.